How you doing, kids? This is Grandpa here, and I wanted to tell you about some old antique technology that I had laying around the house. Because, uh, you know, uh, all you kids nowadays, you guys all got video cameras on your phones. Well, I didn't have a video camera on my phone back in the day, back in 2001. I had to carry this stinking camcorder around. Look how huge this thing is. You can see it right here next to uh, my first-gen iPod. See how big that sucker is? See, it's uh, just a little bit bigger than that. Back in the day, we didn't have the ability to just take a camera or a camcorder or video camera anywhere. We had to take one of these big bulky things around. Uses these little tiny tapes. This one's called a mini DV tape. And you can see compared to your to your uh, iPod that holds like 50,000 songs and 72 built-in motion pictures. I didn't have that back in my day. I had to use these tapes. So I wanted to show you my JVC here. It's a um, it's a DV camcorder. I think it's got the model number on it somewhere down here. Let's let's have a look. Let's have a look. It's a uh, a GR-D250U, and uh, you put this tape in the bottom side here. Let me see if I can figure this out here. There's a there's a button someplace. Oh yeah, here it is. Hey, stupid focus on this stinking iPhone. Back in my day, you didn't have to tap the screen to get the video to focus. You could just point it and shoot it. All right, so I'm going to open this thing up, and I'm going to put this, this here tape in. goes in there like that. Then you squeeze this together, and then your videotape goes on in there. Makes itself at home. Sits down, has a beer too. Out of the fridge, there's a fridge in there too. So, um, so back in the day when uh, we needed to take video, like of the kids at their ball games, or maybe at a, maybe they got their uh, school play, or maybe a choir re rehearsal or something, we had to use these things. That's really cool about it is it actually records digitally, so it's not like those old. Uh, things like my grandpa used to use, uh, those VHS ones he carried on his shoulder. I didn't have that. I, I could at least hold this one in the palm of my hand. It's got a 800x digital zoom. It's got a 25x. You see it right there. 25x optical zoom. It's got a backlight. It's got a focus button. It's got your controls there to, uh, to uh, 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 manage the tape, navigate on the tape that you make. And I'll tell you, kids, when you ran out of tape, you couldn't just go up to the cloud and expand your storage. You had to go buy another tape. So let's see. If I go over here and I put it put it in record mode, I think I'm going to go out on the porch behind the house here. And I'll, I'll shoot a little video for you because it's beautiful springtime weather when this uh, video here was made. Let's go over here to... Uh, you know, I'm going to... No, I don't want to go over there two positions, just one position will be good. All right, so now you can see that the, the little viewfinder there on the side shows the date. There's my date right there, and you can sort of see my fingers there on the side here. Let me zoom out. There we go. Now you can see my hand there in front of the lens. There we go. So um, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll take it out in the back porch here and shoot a little video. And I'll show you how this works. So you, you hold the camcorder in your hand, like this, and you can either look at the view screen here on the side and shoot your video, or you can, you can look through this here viewfinder right here. If I close this up, pull this out. See, now I can look inside here, and I can see my subject in there as well. And it's in color, not black and white, like those old school ones that uh, that my grandpa used to use. So if I take this outside here, now I'm not going to talk a lot when I get outside because I don't want my neighbors thinking I'm just talking to uh, my secret friend or my imaginary friend or something. So, I don't know, looks like it's uh, looks like it's going to rain or snowing or something out here. 
strange. All right, so my uh, my camcorder up here, and uh, I just hit the I hit this button right here with my thumb right there, and you can see that I am shooting video now. And, uh, see, now this is something that your that your uh, iPod can't do is you can't zoom in. See, I can zoom all the way in on my grill there. You can see the, the name brand on it. I can zoom out into this field. I can find a particular tree or something that I want to I want to see. And there you go. Zoom back out. I can take beautiful pictures of the trees swaying in the wind as this massive storm comes into the area, killing everything in its path. All right, so I'm gonna pause it. All right, and we'll go back in the house here. And I'll show you just how good this thing videotapes. Set it back over here on the table. All right, so to play it back, I gotta go over here to the side. And look here, I got a built-in speaker. Switch back over here to play. Okay, and then I gotta rewind my tape. Okay, I hit stop, I hit play. Trees swaying in the wind as this massive storm comes into the area, killing everything in its path. All right, so I'm gonna pause it. All right, so then you see what was uh, what was left on the tape there after it. So anyway, this is just kind of a, an overview of this old thing. It's uh, quite an antique now. I could probably take it to my antique store and sell it for a couple of grand, you know. It's uh, quite a remarkable piece of machinery, and some might even refer to it as a portable television studio. And... Uh, all that and back to the future one time so anyway if you're looking for a little camcorder to uh to take around town and maybe shoot some antique videos or maybe you've got some videos of the kitties and you want to transfer it to a different format you can do that you can hook this up to your computer if you happen to have one of those things i don't know where the slot is i keep spinning it around hoping i'll find it i think it's right here actually let's see there's a little port here on the side that opens up and it reveals some very secret controls. Uh, it's got uh, it's got them somewhere. Oh, they're back in the back. That's where they are. <laughs> Sorry about that, kids. Back in the back here, you pull this little rubber thing down and you've got a, uh, let's see, focus, please got a power cord you got a dv and you got an av output there so you hook your dv up to your computer's dv input it'll look just like that and you can uh, transfer some video off It'll be really fun of course it's not high definition it is digital unlike your iphone 5 you're probably watching this on or iphone 6 or 7 or 8 depending on what year you're watching this video so anyway, uh, this is my review. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Grandpa here signing out. You can subscribe to the Data Bitch channel and see more nonsense just like you've seen here. And uh, please like the video, leave a comment, share it with your friends, and uh, sell it online and make a bunch of money off this video if you want to. I'll catch you later.